Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel, Latina Plants. We're going to do a shop with me today. We're going to go ahead and start at Home Depot. So they still have the Vigoro line for $9.88. They also have these Proven Winners. Leaf Joy line. They have a lot of the same as what they had before, but these are all on sale, you guys. And as you see, they are going pretty fast. Definitely going to have to go and check out what else they get because it looks like they're going to get a restock soon, at least of the Proven Winners line. And here is the Costa Farm Angel line, Exotic Angel line. They are going three for 12. And here they have the large floor plants. Here's the Peace Lilies for $26.98, a great price. They also have the Raven ZZ or the ZZ, sorry, the green version. They have some fiddle leaf figs as well as bird of paradise and yuccas. I think those are yuccas or dracinias. These are on sale for $14.88 as well as the Monstera Deliciosa. And here, all of these pots here are also on sale for $9.88. These are all special buy, Fiddly Fig, Birkins, Pothos, Lemon Meringue in there, some Calatheas, sorry, Aglionemas, some Dracinias in there. They also have some Diffenbachias. Some parlor palms and some peace lilies available in those. Here's a look at more of the Monstera Deliciosa and ZZ pots. Really nice large plants. Some more yuccas, lucky bamboos, some of the red anthuriums, this white syngonium down here. Up top, they have a bunch of the different color orchids. We looked at those before. And down below, they have more of the same um, pots that they had before with the tradescanthias and ferns, as well as begonias and spider plants, and some of those bromeliads. There was a cart here, so I really couldn't get in here to show you these plants, but and try to give you a nice little look. And on my way out, I decided to take a look at these racks here and see if they had anything different. It looks like it's more of the same. I showed these to you guys before. Looks like these plants aren't moving that fast, unfortunately. And I think that is a new mix pot here with some Hoya Crimson Queen. That looks like a good buy there. Really nice full pots, you guys. Check them out. They're on sale as well. And the really large pots on the bottom. They still have some of the arrangements here. And then they had these succulents here that I showed you guys before. It's a lot sunnier this day, so you can kind of see the plants better. It's not so dark and gloomy. It's also earlier in the day, so. Really cute cacti and succulents here. Let me know if you saw anything that you would have picked up or that you like or that you're on the hunt for. Now we're going to head to Lowe's, you guys, and this is the video that you guys want to see. They have some new plants. They were packed, you guys. Some 
new plants here. I believe that's the allocation ninja. I definitely should have snagged her up. I don't know why I didn't. But look at that, you guys. They have the Hoya Pubicalic Splash. I was really shocked to find that at Lowe's. That's the first time I've ever seen a Pubicalic Splash at Lowe's. Had to give you a double take there so you could see it. And I really think that those pots were cute. And they're new from Urban Juggles. They also had the Skindapsis Moonlight looking beautiful and healthy from Costa Farms in the Wick and Grow pots. Some Adansoni eyes and some of these Begonia Maculata, I believe. They are not very happy looking. I don't know if they got cold damage or what, but look at this, you guys. They had a bunch of baskets of the Hoya Curtisii. I'm not the best with the Hoya Curtisii. I am struggling with her. I don't know if it's the plant that I got, but I got two different kinds of plants before, and I still struggle with that plant. But anyways, out of all the Hoyas, that's the one I struggle with. And down below here, they had these beautiful Diffenbachias and ferns. And your usual, you know, Crotons, Sansevierias, Syngoniums, some Begonias. They had the Pothos Jacinia. They also had a Crimson Princess in there. Some of your Ibis, Fetonias, and Ficus. Some teddy bear vine, ferns, and golden pothos. A lot of ferns and pothos in here. Gotta take a look at these Wick and Grows, you guys. Sometimes you will find some nice surprises in there. So I always make it a point to give it a nice little glance. And look at this, you guys, the Hoya Compacta, and just look how long she is. Beautiful. If I had not already had one of my own, I definitely would have snagged her up, you guys. And then here are the shelves. Look at the shelves. They're just packed, you guys, with plants. I could not walk into this aisle because they were stocking some of the plants still, so I didn't want to be in their way. But they're setting up here as well, all these Aglionemas and Calatheas. As you can see, there's some different Bacchias on the ground there. And some of those Dracinias, I believe. They got some new fresh ZZs, some Golden Pothos, and your Sansevieria snake plants. And they also got a new shipment of some African violets. I was so tempted, you guys, in grabbing an African violet. I really like that two-tone pink and also the pale ruffly pink. But I reframed myself because I'm telling you, I propagated so much that I really need to start selling them. But look at this find here, you guys. If you're looking for this philodendron neon... Crocodile, Neon Crocodile, I don't remember what it's called. And also that Aglionema that you saw with the paler white, the Silver Stripe Pothos. And look at this, you guys. I found the Epipremnum Panatum Albo Varigata, you guys. And they had so many, I literally took every single one off the shelf so I could show you guys. And yes, I did put them back after I chose one. Mm -hmm. 